planning a trip to Japan? Want to know about the biggest tourist scams and how to avoid them? Going on a journey should be a joyous occasion, but it's crucial to be aware of potential pitfalls. Even in a country as safe and hospitable as Japan, scams can lurk in the most unexpected places. From the bustling streets of Tokyo to the serene temples of Kyoto, we must always be vigilant. So, let's dive into the top 10 scams you might encounter in Japan. First on our list is the fake police scam. This is where individuals masquerade as law enforcement requesting to inspect your passport or wallet. Always be sure to ask for proper identification and if you're unsure, request to go to the nearest police station. Next, we have the fake monk scam. These are individuals who dress as monks and ask for donations on the streets. Remember, real monks are not typically found begging in tourist areas. Thirdly, beware of rip-off bars. These establishments lure you in with friendly staff, only to charge exorbitant fees once you've ordered your food and drinks. Prioritize your comfort and feel free to leave if the pressure to enter becomes too much. Fourth on our list are fake online rail tickets. These are sold by unauthorized vendors at a discounted price. To avoid this scam, purchase your tickets directly from official websites or authorized vendors. Finally, we have the so-called free tours. These tours are typically offered by individuals who later pressure you into buying overpriced items or services. Stay safe by sticking to reputable tour companies or exploring on your own with a self-guided tour. That's a lot to take in, isn't it? But we're only halfway through. Let's continue on to the next five scams. Next, we have the fake goods scam. In popular tourist areas, some shops might take advantage of the unfamiliarity of tourists, selling counterfeit or low quality items. To ensure the quality and authenticity of your purchases, it's best to stick to reputable stores. Moving swiftly along, let's dive into the murky world of ATM scams. When using ATMs, always be aware of your surroundings and be wary of anyone offering unsolicited help or lingering nearby. Shield your pin when entering it and stick to ATMs located in secure, well-lit areas, preferably inside banks. Now onto the romance scams. These involve individuals who strike up relationships only to manipulate emotions and talk about family troubles or needing large sums of money for a crisis. Remember, if it seems too good to be true, it probably is. Next up, we have the tea ceremony scams. Touristy areas, particularly in Tokyo, are notorious for this. Individuals may approach you offering to take you to a traditional tea ceremony, which turns out to be expensive or involves high-pressure sales tactics. Always be cautious and remember to research before accepting such offers. Finally, we have the issue of assaults on crowded trains. This is primarily a concern for women, especially during peak hours. Opt for women-only trains during these times for a safer journey. And there you have it, the top 10 scams to be aware of while traveling in Japan. Stay vigilant, do your research, and trust your instincts to enjoy a scam-free journey. So, how can you protect yourself from these tourist scams? Remember to always verify the authenticity of police officers, monks, and tour guides. Be wary of too-good-to-be-true deals and only purchase from reputable sources. Maintain privacy when using ATMs and be cautious of unexpected romantic advances. And remember, traditional ceremonies are rarely free. But above all, trust your instincts and do your research. Remember, knowledge is your best defense. Stay alert, stay informed and enjoy your trip to Japan without falling victim to these scams. Safe travels, everyone.